Yeah, I'll do it. You don't go anywhere. Seeking a little poker action. Charlie Rich, a gambler of Cheyenne. Carl Mann, owner of Saloon Number 10. And Captain Massey, a riverboat captain from Missouri. We're engaged in a game of draw poker and we're quick to invite Bill to join them. How's your day going? While Bill's reputation demanded that he be exceedingly cautious. For instance, he never liked to sit with his back to the door. The vacant oh seat God. was so located, no, and a lively debate between Charlie Rich and Bill Thanks. resulted in an attempt on Bill's part to get Charlie's Charlie, chair. what are you doing in my chair? No, it isn't. Oh, I was not how lucky you think it is. And I said, you know what it is. Yeah. 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 took the empty chair. But after a few minutes, he stood up and again asked Charlie for his chair. Dang it, Charlie, I can't sit here, and you know it. Now get out of that chair now. Bill didn't win this argument either, and on this rare occasion, he settled down, sitting with his back to the door. Fine, fine, I'll take your money now, I'll take your chair, Charlie. all knew him to be a left-handed drinker, leaving his right hand free to handle his pistol. As unpredictable as card games are, Bill found himself quickly losing to Nancy, who lost to Bill the night before. Bill asked Harry for $15 worth of pocket checks. Harry brought them over to All Bill right. and returned to the bar you and his duties. Best. Set him up there, Charlie. Mr. Lucky. Oh, five. Soon oh, a shifty nice. drifter known as Jack yeah, McCall yeah. entered the saloon. Bill five. quickly turned while drawing his gun. Recognizing oh. McCall as a newcomer to town, he greeted him with a friendly, Howdy, Jack. Then reholstered his gun and resumed the game. I can't believe he came back <laughs> Jack slowly circled the table, pausing briefly behind each player and Sit analyzing five, each hand. Hey, what are you doing? We don't need you lurking over our shoulders while we're trying to play. Get out of here, kid. <laughs> All right. Five, right? While Bill's right. attention was on Massey, we'll there was a friendly argument mean? between them. Give and while Bill remarked, There are some good ones out here, Massey. Upon returning directly behind Wild Bill, suddenly Jack McCall. The bullet struck Bill in the back of the head, and out his left cheek, and lodged in Captain Massey's left arm. It was discovered soon after the cards Bill was holding were aces and eights, forever known as the dead man's hand. All fled the saloon except Carl Mann, who was held at bay by McCall. Jack snapped the trigger of his gun several times. It failed to fire. He then ran out the door and up the street. He was trying to take him out of the butcher shop. Later on in the day, he was caught in a minor's court. The jury, being tainted and influenced by a deceitful defense, found McCall not guilty, and he was released. This decision not only outraged the judge, but also the general populace. McCall left the camp in haste. Upon reaching supposed safety in Wyoming, he began bragging of his ennobled deed.